Welcome to our lecture online. Now what do we do when we have to square a complex number? Well, it's like squaring a binomial. When we see something like this, that means we're going to take the first term squared plus the last term squared plus twice the product of the two. So essentially, it becomes as follows. So it's the first term squared, 3 times 3, which is 9, plus the last term squared. That would be 25i squared plus twice the product of the two. So plus 2 times the product of these two, which is a minus 15i. All right. So then when we simplify that, we get 9 minus 30i and 25 times i squared. Remember that i squared is a negative 1, so this becomes a minus 25. And when we add that to the 9, this is equal to minus 16 minus 30i. And that would be the final result of squaring that complex number. Notice when we square a complex number, we still get a complex number. Here we do the same thing as before. We multiply this times this. So minus times the minus gives us plus. That gives us 25i squared. Minus 5i times 3 gives us minus 15i. 3 times a minus 5i gives us a minus 15i. And 3 times 3 gives us a positive 9. When we add all these together, we get 9 minus 30i and 25 times i squared. Remember that i squared is negative 1. That gives us minus 25. Then we add these two together. That gives us minus 16 minus 30i, which is the same that we got on the left side of the board. And that is how it's done.